Hi everyone, welcome to the visual guide for Some All. This is the second instance made available through the main scenario questline in Final Fantasy XIV, Heavensward. My name is Miss Tech and I'll be your dungeon guide. You may get a feel of a few previous dungeons from this one, so use what you know when dealing with the trash. These dark spur pods will spawn pollen clusters that will explode if touched, similar to the pods in Todorak. Have your range clear these up as necessary. The first boss is Raskovnik. This boss has a few familiar abilities to T6's Rathlesia. The first is Acid Rain, a cast ground AoE on every player that should be dodged as necessary. Next up, Rasko will cast Sweet Scent, attracting bees to him. These bees do no damage and will slowly move to him and should be killed as soon as possible. At the same time, a player will be marked with this familiar marker, indicating that they will soon be sucked in. Rasko will suck in the affected player, stunning them for 2 seconds. Marked players should move to the outer edge of the arena to be able to run out of the device AoE in time. Any bees in melee range that have not been killed at the time of devour will be eaten and will give Rasko a damage increase buff. The more bees he eats, the more damage he'll do, so destroying these is very important. Heal through the spit and repeat until he's dead. Easy peasy. The next set of trash has you slaying many dragons. Dragons can be pretty dangerous, so watch your feet. You'll deal with a few elements which you'll soon see again. The next boss is Myath, a cool looking dino with a very dexterous tail. Myath can hit the tank relatively hard, so be on the defensive. He has a wide AoE frontal that should be avoided as necessary. Over the fight, he will cast Primordial Roar, which will do damage to the raid and spawn a number of colored goops. I would recommend killing these as soon as possible. Myath will pick up goops with his tail and cast Mad Dash, which will hurl the glob at a marked player doing massive damage. Healers need to be ready to heal up as players will probably not survive more than one hit of these Clubs. The last thing to look out for is this massive chyme of the mountain that will cast the last song. If you've learned anything by now, you should know now that these long scary casts mean danger. Destroy this as fast as possible or get ready for some intense AoE healing. The fight will repeat until the boss is down. This last set of trash is again very simple. More elemental dragons, more AoE poop puddles. The last boss is Teoman, one of the most badass looking dragons we've seen so far. As with most dragons, Teoman has a large frontal breath, so tanks be sure to keep him pointing away from the group. Teoman will also cast Chaos Blast, which will put out a long column and circle AoE on all players. Dodge these as necessary. Next thing to watch for is Comet. A number of AoE circles will spawn that should be avoided. Two players will also be marked with these familiar green markers and will drop meteors where they are standing when the marker disappears. As you can see, these meteors will deal damage based on proximity to them, and I would recommend dropping these as far away as possible to negate any incoming damage. This will continue until around 43%, at which point Teo Man will move to the center and become immune. Instead, the group will damage him by attacking his wings. At the same time, a player will be marked with this yellow symbol, indicating that they will be hit with Heaven's Fall, a number of AoE ground circles. The affected player should move away from the rest of the group to drop the AoE circles away from the party while everyone else focuses down the wing. The remaining wing will regain all of its health when the other dies, so focus one down at a time. Once the wings are down, Tiamon will become vulnerable again and the fight repeats. Remember to avoid AoEs and drop comments away as necessary. And there you have it, some all. It's a pretty cool place for a leveling dungeon, and I hope we see a hard mode of it in the future. If you have any questions or comments, please let me know. Up next, we'll fly into the Airy. As always, thanks for watching. Till next time.